Welcome Shopify fans. In this video, I want to show you how we can have an email pop-up just like Allo. We've seen it on many different stores and actually sent them the discount code. This is something I see many times. People say get 50% off, yet you never receive an email with the code. It's very simple to integrate. Just follow along and you will have a very similar feature. We need only a couple of things. Let me opt out. We need an email pop-up and then we need a discount code and an email that delivers the discount code. So I'm just gonna start with the discount code. I think we already set one up, but I'm gonna create a new one. So we just click create discount. We, you can of course specify what exactly you want. I'm gonna give a amount of total order. So I'm gonna do an order discount and we're just gonna give it a name like uh, welcome 10, meaning this is a 10% discount, no minimum requirements, available for all customers. It can only be used one time per customer because this is a welcome discount and then technically you can think or you can uh, enable multiple discounts if you have multiples available but for this I'm just gonna leave it as is hit save and we have a discount code that's all we have to do step two we need a pop-up there is uh, many apps we can use for that if you are not using a service like Klaviyo MailChimp they have their own uh, pop-ups if you don't use them then Shopify has their own app I like to use forms. It's just called forms. We already have it installed. You can just search for forms and then you'll see this little icon, this pinkish icon. That's the Shopify forms. It's free. So I'm just going to create one now. We want a pop-up. We can also have an inline. We're going to call it email collection, create. Then I want an overlay. We can also have a floating. It always floating means it's always there and you can still interact with the site. Overlays like the traditional pop-up we just saw. You can see this is how it would look. You can of course customize it, what, um, what it's gonna say. Don't miss out, bottom left. Um, complete the form to sign up. Instead of just sign up, I think we should say, um, get 10% off when you sign up. and uh, or sign up and save and then here get 10% off your first order this is all we need name email submit perfect we are pretty much done with this so I'm just gonna hit save of course you can spend more time to customize it but that's all we need to collect the email so we hit save here and uh, now the first thing I want to do before we actually add the sending of this email is we're gonna to go to the store so we don't forget and then we're gonna enable the pop-up. So in here, I'm gonna click customize. You guys probably know the drill by now. We click app embeds. You should see the forms here. I'm gonna enable it, meaning now it's ready to show up. You can already see it's showing. We can even preview it. And we should receive a pop-up. There it is, sign up and save, perfect. But now, even if we were to sign up, and usually, to be honest, I think we should exclude the first name. That's definitely gonna hurt our conversion. So I'm gonna open up the app again, go to forms. And then in the email collection form, I now actually want to remove the first name. Email we always need so that you can't do anything wrong, but that's all that we needed. You can also add other fields, even a custom one but that's to be honest, all that we need. So now we have the form showing up. Whenever someone subscribes, they will actually will be added to our customer list as a subscriber, just how it should work, but still they're actually not getting a code yet. What we want to do for that is we want to use now our email app, could be Clayview, could be MailChimp, but if you're watching this and you don't have one yet, just use the Shopify's own email app. It's called email. You see it here. It's very similar in terms of design from forms. Just search for email, click on this one. This is free. I think we can send up to 10,000 emails per month for free. And then in here, we can create a campaign or an automation. Automation is what we're looking for. Campaign, you can just think of as a newsletter or a one-off email. Automation is something, as the name implies, whenever something happens, a trigger is being triggered. We want an automated campaign being sent out. That's, of course, what we want. We don't want to send manual emails with discount codes. In here, you can see there's already some templates and there's even a template that we need. It's called welcome new subscribers. So we just click on this. We're gonna use this template. If you don't have the Shopify Flow app installed, it's gonna let you know to install it. This is just, it's also a free Shopify app. 
This is just where we can then modify this automation. It should open up and then this is what we're seeing. So I'm just walking you through the flow. Customers subscribe to email marketing, meaning they gave us their email. Um, they didn't subscribe at checkout, meaning if they purchase something, then they don't need to get this email because they're now already, um, or they didn't subscribe and give us the confirmation to actually receive emails. So this is only for the email pop-up. And then in here, this is the email that's being sent that's marked with this email app. You can see the, the email here. This is what we get by default, but we can just go in, edit email. And then you'll notice it already has an apply discount section. So you just click it and it's gonna prompt you to select a discount. And this is where we select our discount that we just created, welcome 10. And then if you wanna hide some sections, technically we can even remove this. We just wanna show them the discount and everything else we leave as a template. We wanna make sure everything is saved. I believe it auto saves. Maybe it doesn't auto save. Oh yeah, we still have to create subject. So here's your discount code. I think that's all we need. And of course, I actually can save it because this is a test account, this is not a live account. So for you, it should just save or have a save button. You can also then set it to active. That's all that's missing. And that's pretty much it. A user then subscribes and they automatically re receive this email saying, welcome to the list, whatever we put in this email. Here's your discount code. And then when they click the button, the discount will automatically apply it to their entire store session. So they can actually check out, they can browse, they can add things to the card and they don't have to use the code. They can immediately or they automatically get the discount applied. All at the end that we have to do, turn on workflow. Nothing's gonna happen for us because this is, you can see this is a test account. We can actually send emails, but that's it. This is how we add an automatic discount code that's being sent out. If you wanna learn more about Shopify, join our community, our courses at effortless-e.com and I'll see you in the next video.